Dear students, in this topic, we shall discuss the electrocardiogram, commonly known as ECG. You know that cardiac impulses are based on depolarization and repolarization of the cardiac muscle fibers. These cardiac impulses cause electrical changes while passing through the heart muscles. The electrical current generated in this process spreads to the adjacent tissues. Some of this current spreads to all body surface. This spread of the current to the body surface forms the basis of recording of the electrocardiogram. Dear students, the electrical potentials generated by the current can be recorded by placing electrodes of an instrument which is called electrocardiograph on the skin at certain locations. As a result, the electrical changes in the heart can be recorded and these recordings are known as electrocardiogram. An electrocardiogram is in the form of a graph that reflects the various phases of the heart beat. It reflects depolarization and repolarizations as wave deflections. These wave deflections represent specific events of cardiac cycle. In wave deflections go हम मुख्तलिफ designations देते हैं और इसके मुख्तलिफ segments के मुख्तलिफ नाम रखे जाते हैं तीन major wave deflections जो हैं उनमें पहली जो है that is a P wave दूसरी एक QRS complex और तीसरी जो है वो T wave कहलाती है Now we shall discuss these three major waves in detail. The P wave is caused by the electrical potentials when atria depolarize. It occurs just prior to the contraction of atria. Jis wak P wave appear hoti hai, us dauran mein uh, ventricles are in diastole. Dear students, the interval of time between the start of the P wave to the beginning of the QRS complex is known as the PR interval. Ye jo interval hai, this indicates the amount of time which is required for the sinoatrial node depolarization to reach the ventricles. Sinoatrial depolarization जो है ये ventricles तक कितनी देर में पहुंचती है PR interval ये timing show करता है The QRS complex comprises of three separate waves ये तीनों waves एक दूसरे के साथ इस तरह से linked हैं कि हम इने एक अठा एक complex के तौर पर treat करते हैं This complex begins as a short downward deflection which is called Q wave. Then it continues as a sharp upward spike. Is spike ko R wave kehte hain. Then it ends as a downward deflection. Ye jo wave banti hai ise S wave kehte hain. The QRS complex indicates depolarization of ventricles. In this interval, 
ventricles are in systole that is blood is being ejected from the ventricles of the heart dear students the t wave is known as repolarization wave it is caused by the potentials which are generated when ventricles recover from the state of depolarization and repolarize yahan pe the interval or duration between the completion of depolarization of ventricles and initiation of its repolarization is known as the st segment t wave shuru hone se pehle aur qrs complex ke khatme tak ye jo darmiyan mein interval hai ye interval st segment kehlata hai and it represents ke ab depolarization khatam ho rahi hai aur repolarization hone lagi hai this segment in a normal ecg must be flat dear students electrocardiogram is an important clinical test for the diseases of the heart koi bhi heart disease jo heart ki electrical activity ko disturb kar sakti hai that produces characteristic types of changes in the patterns of ecg waves isliye understanding of these wave deflections and their patterns is clinically important